Hey guys, so I'm back with another video and today's video is going to be a lipstick review on the L'Oreal Paris Infallible Pro Matte Liquid Lipstick. And I have two dark shades. The first shade is Milk and Cookies 364 and then Cowboy and 358. Now these shades are fairly like dark. This one's like an orangey brown and then this one's like a definitely like a cookie shade brown. So I got these sent to me for free a long time ago. I can't remember if it was by Influencer or if it was by something else. I don't remember. But I'm going to do a swatch review and what I think about these. And honestly, I've used them a few times and I like them. So first, I'm just going to read to you what it says online. So it says, liquid matte finish, up to 16 hour wear. High impact color, comfortable wear. The Pro Matte Sensation, in introducing Infallible Pro Matte Liquid Lipstick, our first up to 16 hour matte liquid lipstick, intense high pigment shades create comfortable, lasting ultra matte color. This full coverage, long wear liquid lipstick feels light for all day comfort with the pearl sculpt applicator shape add dimension to the lips. So the first thing I love about these is the packaging. I think it's really nice. My second favorite thing is um, the wand. I love the wand. And the formula is amazing. The smell I love. Sorry, got a text message. Um, so, yeah, so these are definitely great for fall. So this one is called Cowboy. I'll swatch it on my hand first. A very, very pigmented. So here's Cowboy. Right here. These actually kind of smell a little bit chocolatey. And here's Milk and Cookies. Milk and Cookies right here. So the first one I'll do is milk and cookies on my lips. So I wish all liquid lipsticks had an applicator like, th like this because I find it easy to apply with it. That's one swipe on the bottom lip. One swipe, that's how pigmented it is. So here is the full color on my lips. Funny story behind this. My mom's like, "Is what color is on your lips? She goes, it looks like a poop color. And I was like, gee, thanks, mom. I normally don't wear dark shades like this because I just don't like it. But it's great for fall or a fall makeup tutorial. And they're already drying down nicely. So here's milk and cookies on my lips. that one and it's already drying it dries really fast within a couple of seconds and the comfortable wear is definitely true all of it on the website it's all true I agree with it 100% I'm just going to take it off now So I can do the other swatch. It 
The only thing I do not know is if it really lasts up to six, 16 hours, but the way it feels and dries, it definitely feels like it would. I do know that it lasts up to at least seven because I have worn it that long. Seven hours is a long time to wear lipstick, in my opinion. So now it's time for Cowboy, and to be honest, I'm probably going to give this shade away because this shade is definitely not my shade. I can't see myself wearing this color. I might keep it, but I don't know. So here's Cowboy. And the reason is because it's just not my, you know. I don't know, I just don't like this color. Here's Cowboy. I might keep the other one because that's more of a true brown. This is more of an orange brown. So I'm not digging this color, but it is really nice. And I can't wait to get it off my lips because it does not look good. Some people just can't pull off certain colors. And you know what? That's okay because not everybody's skin tone. is made for colors like this. I think these colors will look beautiful on a darker skinned person, to be honest with you. But not for somebody like me with white skin. Okay, so that's my final review on this. If you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up because that helps. Let me know what you guys like. And if you guys have any questions about this lipstick or anything, or if you guys have any video ideas you guys want me to make, please let me know because I'm kind of running out of ideas again. You know, I'm not, um, I'm not constantly thinking of, oh, what should I do? What should I do? You know, I've got a lot of other stuff going on in my life that I can't always, you know, pay attention to, oh, what I want to film. But I do have so much stuff I could do videos with, but I don't know. So that's everything for this video, and I will see my next video. Bye-bye.